Hey everybody, welcome back again to Ken Tamplin Vocal Academy where the proof is in the singing. I'm doing a series and the series is called What Makes This Singer Great? And next up is Robert Plant. Before we get started, if you wouldn't mind, please like and subscribe to my channel, that would be awesome. And don't forget to ring that bell so I can keep more great videos coming your way. And I have a singing course and the course is called How to Sing Better Than Anyone Else. You can find it right here at kentamplinvocalacademy.com where we discuss and negotiate all the different techniques and styles of what it takes to make these guys a great singer in hopes to help make you a great singer. So we're going to take on uh, Robert Plant. Now, what comes to my mind? What first comes to mind when I think of Robert Plant? Well, I think of timelessness, you know, legendary rock star. That's one thing. Um, I think of high range and uh, some really interesting, great distorted vocals. He has a, good, a lot of really cool distortion. Um, I think of some of the interesting kind of Celtic Irish sounding ballad you know, like, you know, over the hills and far away and going to California and like all the acoustic elements that are, were brought into rock music back then, which wasn't that common. Um, I think of him as being kind of psychedelic, kind of 70s psychedelic, uh, for sure. Um, I think of him being mystical, a very mystical Nordic mysticism songwriting, you know, that he en enjoyed a lot. Uh, I think of him as, as a belter, very powerful singer, especially in his high range. Um, Jimmy Page comes to mind. Uh, you know, it's hard to separate Robert Plant, Jimmy Page. To me, they kind of go together as a package. Um, what else? Uh, I think uh, maybe one of the greatest rock influences, vocal influences of all time, right? Think about that. Um, I think of songs, Stairway to Heaven, Going to California. By the way, I've covered Going to California. I've covered some Zeppelin songs already, and I'll put those in the description tag so you can hear. Um, and I did, I've done some with my students as well. So I'll put everything I have released to date, I'll put those in the description so you can check out and see how we did, I did, uh, singing Zeppelin stuff. But um, I think a whole lot of love, you know. Um, I think of the Immigrant song. I think of Kashmir. Um, I think of um, I don't know, Ramble On, which I did, rock and roll. Um, so again, I'll put all that in the subject. But I want you guys to tell me and put in uh, the comments sections what comes to your mind when you think of Robert Plant. And I'm going to dive into some actual live music now. So, But it's a little difficult on some of this older stuff to get good quality footage because I don't think it was the best representation of you know all of Robert Plant. So we grab what we can and what YouTube will allow us or the publishing companies will allow us to use. Uh, some, some decent footage here. But uh, with that said, let's just kind of dive right in and... Don't oh, let the sun be down upon my face Stars to fill my dreams I am a traveler of both time He's also very space. nasally Traveler of both time and space There was a lot of guys who used a lot of nasality, especially back then Sit with elders of a different race This world is seven Very psychedelic, right? Kind of druggy. I think the movie song remains the same. And something else I think of personally is I think of John Bonham. I think without John Bonham, I'm not sure the band would have had anywhere near the same groove and funk factor and feel with a lot of this stuff. So he contributed significantly. And as did John Paul Jones. I think he's a very underrated uh, behind the scenes guy, but he also contributed significantly to um, Led Zeppelin. So again, this is just, just this package that came together. Now I know Robert uh, went on later and you know did some jazz stuff and whatnot, uh, which was pretty cool. Um, they called it Americana back then, you know, with Diana Krall and some other people he worked with. but um, And that was cool, but my, my main staple for him is uh, remembering him and Led Zeppelin and kind of all the stuff he's done here, so. friends out there, I want to point out some things about Robert Plant, okay? Now, I just did, I've done um, some Zeppelin stuff, so check out, you know, my approach to it. I approached it more like the way I would want to do it technically, but he's a little deceiving because um, I just did, I don't know when I'm going to release all this stuff, so I'm not sure if that'll be out in time for you to check it out, but it's coming out soon. But um, I did uh, Since I've Been Loving You, for example, and a lot of that stuff is um, very head voice driven, very falsetto driven, and it sounds like he's pulling chest 
all the way up into his head voice, and he's really not. That's true for going to California and some other things like that, where he's actually coming in from using head voice and bringing head voice down a reinforced falsetto down into his upper belting range, and it makes it sound like he's belting really high, when in fact he's actually not. He's using head voice reinforced falsetto with some distortion to make you think that you're hearing, a, a, again, a pulled chest sound of, you know, kind of pulling a lot of muscle mass and girth in the throat up really high, and that's not what's going on. It wouldn't be sustainable very long if, in fact, he was doing that, and so uh, I just want to make that side note for my singer friends out there. I cover that in my singing course so we can negotiate and talk all about that in the course. Also, I have a singing forums, guys. If you want to go to my KenTampleInVocalAcademy.com, um, I have a free singing forum. You can sign up for free and check out and see you know, all the different people discussing the different topics and you know whatnot. Discussing, not discussing. Uh, here we go. Oh, we all know this one. All that glitters is gold. Got it. All buying. He was kind of an effeminate dresser. It was kind of interesting back then. It didn't seem to fit his um, kind of manly persona in that sense, but he did nonetheless dress She's kind of effeminate. You know, it was interesting. Love that. He's kind of locked up there, so so no, let me make that point, okay? So remember me saying about bringing the head voice and bringing it down? In this case, he's not, so he's belting, and a lot like what happens with guys like, you know, I'm gonna use you know Brian Johnson as a good example from ACDC, you get to a point where the larynx gets stuck and you can't release and relax and you can't go any higher, so it's just it, it hits a ceiling and that's it, and you just can't do it until you actually, you can, there's massaging techniques, you can actually take your fingers and you can go like this and massage and pull the laryngeal's position down. You can feel it's your Adam's apple, you can feel, kind of pull it down and then kind of shake it side to side, real gently all the way down the throat and it'll relax and release and you can go back and go up and get some notes. I don't know if he knew to do that back then. Um, but I want to back this up a little bit. You can hear he can't sing the notes because he gets stuck in that laryngeal position and he can't sing any higher. Check it out. That's all he's got. Notice if he relaxes for a minute, he gets a little back, right? So anyway, I point all this technical stuff out because all this technical stuff is really important if you want to learn how to sing like this or beyond that or different styles and genres. So again, I'm doing the series, what makes a singer great. So if you've got a singer you'd like for me to cover, uh, please put it in the comment section. If I missed something or there's something else that reminds you of Led Zeppelin or particularly Robert Plant, um, please put that in the comment section so it makes it for a more well-rounded approach, not just Ken Tamplin's uh, you know, viewpoints and whatnot. And uh, stick around because I have another cool video headed your way. Check it out.